Hello guys, welcome back to your knowledge kit. Today I'm going to share with you another episode for scholarships. If it is your first time to come across this channel, we do offer a device for scholarship applications and the other opportunities which you can find abroad. There are several scholarships in the 2023-2024 which I have posted on my channel if you wish to study for free in 2023 consider to watch all those videos and choose the program which is convenient for you so today i'm going to talk about sui swedish scholarship which is swedish institute scholarship this scholarship it is it is offered by the swedish institute and it has opportunity for it is a fully funded and there are several countries which are eligible we will cover in this video the overview of this program what it includes criteria how to apply and frequently ask the questions about the scholarship now to be eligible for the SCI scholarship for global pass global professionals you must be a citizen of 41 countries which are I will be showing you how sufficient documented proof of work experience and leadership experience. Also follow the application for admission step by step. I also remind you that in this application for scholarship, you apply for university separately to the scholarship program. We will see all of these in details. The application opens for application 10th February. So from 10th February, you can start for the application. This is an official website. I will post the link in my link description so that you can follow and get more information. SCI Scholarship for Global Professionals aims to develop future global leaders that will contribute to the United Nations 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development and to Sustainable Development. The applicant should have a clear idea of how their education will contribute to sustainable development of their home countries and regions so once you make your motivation you have to read these sentences then you can write your motivation referring to these sentences in the 2023 the swedish institute will grant about 350 scholarships for masters so 350 scholarships are the many guys you can try for your chance the scholarship is intended for full-time or one year or two years master's program will depend on your preferences and it is founded by the minister of foreign affairs the Swedish Institute opened the course for application once every year for master's studies begin in the autumn semester. 
so you don't apply any time for this scholarship it is only applied you start your studies in this semester in the autonomous semester in order to have a su successful application make sure first to be eligible complete all steps of the process and that you have the document required to finalize your application any time what's included what you get as scholarship recipient it is a fully funded scholarship a monthly stipend of 11,000 Swedish money to cover your living expenses also you get insurance cover, cover, covers travel grant from your country to and from membership for the SI network for future global professionals so once you finish you will still be in touch with this network and it will help you to keep the mind of international arena and different opportunities the scholarship does not provide additional grant apart from what you discussed it doesn't cover the application fee at the university application allow changes to the study program if there are some changes they don't cover them allow extension or changes to the hour scholarship period now eligibility i'll show you a list of countries which are eligible so there are some countries which are eligible and also you are required to have a minimum working hours for 3000 showing your work experience you are not eligible if regardless of the eligibility criteria listed above you are not eligible for scholarship for global professionals if you have already resided in sweden for a period of two years or more have previously awarded this kind of scholarship or you have a degree from sweden university or currently in enrolled in sweden or have a swedish or european union citizenship or have a dual citizenship in any countries not listed on the list once you click on this link you will see the list of these countries also countries of citizenship you must be a citizen, a citizen of one of the listed countries those countries which are eligible here is the list you can pass through them to see if you are eligible before you apply eligible programs so before so you start your application you have to check your program the program which you want to apply check the university you apply for admission then after applying for admission the next step will be to apply for the scholarship so once you click on on this link you will find the list of programs offered and the their respective universities in terms of your university application you must be you will read also the following sentences here about those who are exempted for the school fees you have to pay the application fee for your masters before the, the first february 
so the admission requires a fee payment it also be admitted and conditionally con or conditionally admitted to one of the eligible masters Also, you are required to have at least 3,000 hours. Once you read the whole, the whole information, you will find how you can create this working experience. You can read the scenario here of how you can create your working hours. Also, you can read more information on how you can show the leadership experience and this should be included in your motivation letter now let's look at the required documents first is a cv you can also check online i will show there is here down there i have given a template for the format which you have to use there is a cv letters of reference also they have a template value completed proof of work and leadership experience there is also a template copy of your passport and motivation right data so this motivation letter will be asked in the application portal you will need to upload now there is here a format for a cv once you click on this arrow this flash you will get the form and there is also the format for letter of reference and you need two letters are mandatory one should be from academic another one for your work proof of work experience there is a format here also a template which you have to fill and your passport now when it comes on the application once you click on the first step they will bring you here uh, apply up to four eligible masters program at the university admission don't don't dot ce you have to apply before before this deadline now once you have submitted your application for masters program you can also proceed for you can proceed for the scholarship here there, are, there is a list of the masters programs which are eligible for scholarships so you can click here on this link then you see if you are already eligible or, or you can check your preference for masters according to your background as i said the second step is the application for the scholarship after you have applied for the admission you can proceed for the scholarship then you will wait for the screening and then notification then final evaluation and announcement if you have been awarded the scholarship so guys thank you for listening consider to subscribe like and share with your friends for this information to reach many people who are interested for pursuing their studies abroad in this 2023. Thank you and also explore more on this channel about the scholarships and opportunities abroad. Thank you.